Hey, it's Kayla, respiratory therapist. Today, I wanted to talk about something that has been brought up quite a lot by PAP users. And it's something that a lot of us have run into, but haven't always had a name for. Aerophagia. If you've ever had issues with abdominal distension, bloating, gas, excessive burping, farting, or just being uncomfortable after using your CPAP, you're not alone. Aerophagia is defined as swallowing air, and honestly, it can really make or break your comfort with your therapy. Now, here's the thing. Sometimes the fix is simple, like changing from a full face mask to a nasal mask so that you can vent that excess pressure, or adjusting your sleeping position, maybe making some dietary changes, but it's not always that straightforward. And this is where a little story is gonna come in. Let's imagine Jimmy. Jimmy is on a CPAP and it's supposed to automatically adjust to his needs, an APAP. But if the machine is set too high and that mask isn't fitting right, the machine could continue to just keep ramping up that pressure. Suddenly, Jimmy's waking up feeling like a balloon and it's not because he's had a big meal. It's because that machine is going overboard. What I wanna advocate here is, if you have addressed mask fit, have supplies that have been replaced on a timely schedule, and you continue to feel uncomfortable with high pressures, it's okay to talk to your doctor about adjusting that pressure range. It's not about blaming anybody, it's about making sure that you're comfortable and that your therapy is actually working for you so that you can achieve that productive sleep. If you're feeling like you're swallowing air and it's making you miserable and you've done these basic troubleshooting steps, there's other options. You deserve to feel comfortable and not give up on that CPAP journey just because there's some pressure setting discrepancies. Let's get you feeling better and not like you're gonna float away or far.